I can scarcely feel any sentiment which is not accompanied by the image of a flower or a fruit. To a flower, the whole being of the dreamer relaxes. The flower born in poetic reverie, then, is the very being of the dreamer, his flowering being. dominates all the gardens of the earth. Thus the images of the poet's reveries dig life deeper. Flowers and fruits, beauties of the world, in order to be dreamed well, they must be spoken and spoken well. The dreamer of objects only finds the accents of ephemeral enthusiasm. What supports he receives when the poet tells him, you have seen well, therefore, 